Grab your battle passes, your smite gems, your video games, and an exclusive in-game title only available if you purchase $50 or more from our Nexus store so you can become the exemplar. Use the description in the link down below. Do I, I literally don't actually know what to get first. His one is really not good. Yeah. In terms of clear, I, mean, I just in terms of clear, I just bad It's got other cool things I mean, like, that it does. One, if you throw your one on the wave, then at least it's a lot of like area denial, I guess. Yeah, I guess it hits the archers, so like at least you get some mm -hmm. archer damage, which is you know, mm -hmm. and it's a slightly lower cooldown than the two. The one is a lot of oh man, they don't want to step in there if they don't want to get tickled. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. I mean, no, nobody likes being tickled. Like, oh, I'm just kidding. Okay. Go ahead and pick that right back up. What's up, Yuri? I honestly should not have even used my ability on the on this purple. I would have been way better off just auto attacking it's the nice purple. Mid. So that's something to keep in mind for sure. All right. That was so. It's honestly embarrassing. <laughs> That means Poseidon it is. Looking to pick him up. Whoop. Okay. Yeah. 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 I hate that it does the auto on it. I mean, at least. I mean, that's a, that's a kind of a cool combo with Neath, I guess. That's yeah. something. You like, I like pull them into an easy route. Archers hurt. Mm -hmm. That's cool. Oh, buddy, that's a weave. Yeah, it is. Okay. An ally has been slain. I'm not, I'm not gonna lie, I really thought he had rolled out, but he was just in his VXG. <laughs> <laughs> I 100% oh, thought he rolled out. I'm sorry. Mm hmm. Um. Yeah, his two yeah, is his far best far ability I by far. Like... By far. I'm gonna maybe look to. Boop. And then. Boop. They're tremor. That's something. <gasps> yeah. It's got Damn. really good body blocks, though. All right. I'll tell you right now, in the first three levels, he feels way better in the dueling than he did anywhere okay. else. <laughs> it's nice purple? not having to clear as him, because I ain't. I ain't gonna. You can't make me. You can't make me even if you want to. Although, you know what? Yeah, there's a Geb just hanging out here. Atlas's one is the closest thing that we've gotten to Thumpa in a long time. Not familiar with Thumpa. You're not familiar with Thumpa? Vulcan's no, turret? No. Thumpa? Oh. He, it's kind of a Thumpa. Like, that's exactly what Thumpa used to do. And he used to do 14 damage as well. And we loved Thumpa, so maybe we could come to love Orby. Maybe. Yeah. I, well, unfortunately, was not in the beta. <laughs> Everybody loves Zamba. <laughs> but now he's Orby. I can hop on that hype train. Zamba yes, was doing his best. He always they was. Really, just the uh, Nazar cracking the Terra mid. The Nazar cracking the Terra mid. Yeah. That's terrifying. I have, have a Kraken. I'm gonna pick up Chiron and then throw him to you. Yeah! You're meditating? He's doing reduced damage. Gab is doing slightly reduced damage. I'm running. I'm gonna turn around and pick him up. Okay. Yoink. Slowing. Roll out. Oh, I have no mana. Oh, okay. 
I really gave a lot of effort into his getaway. As suspected, his getaway is bad. Yeah. <laughs> As, this is bad good. I put a lot into that, but he just he just he doesn't have a lot of It's because his three is just not a good getaway skill. It's a pretty decent aggressive skill. You know? I literally, I can't help but just think of it as a Medusa dash. It's quite good offensively, but when you need it for the defense, you're like, this is very lackluster. For some you know? reason, I feel like that second throw didn't throw him very far at all. Well, it doesn't. It really, it really tosses them up. Like once That's you fair. pull them, like, you, you can move with them a little bit, but it really tosses them like just in front of like your location. Okay. I'm at mid. Farewell, sweet okay. prince. Farewell, sweet prince. That's thank on you. me for being a crush. Thank you, thank you, thank you. If his dash was slow immune, it would be significantly better. You'd probably do more damage It would. I'm gonna pick up an edge off. Doink. Okay. No, it's in Chiron. Pretty sure she's on his scorpion. Wait, did you go Terra mid? Yes. Okay. And then he's on mid too. Okay. No judgment. I went Atlas mid, and that was objectively terrible. So you know. They are on the scorpion. I lied. They, were on they are here. They indeed are, and he is fast. He is really fast. I'm Just keep running, keep running. I'm pulling him off you. I'm being ulted. Hey, can't stop that. That was Gebel. I hear a Gebel out. I see no, a Gebel out. Your right okay. tower is under attack. How much does my ulti damage actually do? A big fat 100, 100? base damage. Oh, 100. Okay. 100. Assuming you don't hit him with Are the other part. The I got you back, brother. Ah, rats. Because if they sit in the other part, it does a little bit more, but it's 25 damage a tick. Which so means it actually does like 12. Curtain. It's certainly no gavel. Yeah. <laughs> Like he has an ultimate that on paper sounds really good because it reduces their protections and power by so much. Um, non-shot alt and beads. But in actuality, I think that like at almost every level of gameplay, no something that just does more damage and stuns is just better. You know, like sometimes just more straightforward is just better. Like, you know Geb's gonna go in, he's gonna ulti, and then congrats, you've got a low HP target to kill. What's up, Bama? Looking up a side, I guess. Yoink. Recharging my ult. That is a he's really crazy fast, fast Poseidon. I got like a 12 man ulti off. Freedom! Compressing down. Oh. I'm trying to pull him. I got. Oh. She's always. Good luck. Jeez. He's also seemingly much better at peeling backline than he is at initiating. That I believe. Cause he doesn't have a he doesn't have a lot of ways to like get into the fight. And even if you blink on him, <laughs> then what? It doesn't really matter. Yeah, the blink doesn't really matter. 
Because he doesn't have like a like a fast enough follow up for an ability. He doesn't have like a blink a blinkle or something, you know. It's an alt in. Um. Alt going in upside. Yeah. There's not. There's like. I don't even. I don't even see a reason to get blink. I don't think you buy blinks on him. There's no. There is no follow. I guess. I guess you could go for a blink and grab somebody. But like your grab is. This is how long it takes. There are four people in between. There's no way. Yeah, it's like takes, it takes way, way too long to go for like a bling grab, you know? The one thing that I will say is that his kit is really cool and has a lot of unique features and the features themselves are good. So even if things, even if his animations take too long or if his damage is garbage or whatever, 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 because they didn't want him to be anything but a support, his kit itself is totally fine. So even if he ends up being quite subpar, which I think that there's a good shot that he yeah. ends up being quite subpar. His, his uh, capabilities are there. It's not, it's not like he just has a bad kit that's not designed well for Smite. You know what I'm saying? The kit's well thought out. It's well designed. It's obviously meant to be a support. It just doesn't have the exact things that it needs. It either needs to be faster or a lower cooldown or more damage, whatever way they want to take it. You know what I'm saying? Whatever way they want to take his design, but it's, it's the easy things that need to be changed, not like, it's not Enemies like, oh, this ability is will never work. You know what I'm saying? It's just like, oh, this ability just isn't very good right now. But he also has a ton of numbers that you can scale. He's got his like his pre-fire, post-fire times, build up animations could all be tweaked. His his cooldowns are really high, those could be tweaked. Damage numbers. How fast his orb comes back to him. You know what I'm saying? Like he has a lot of that kind of stuff. Yoink. Trying to pick up. Alice got him. Okay. I'm really trying. He's slow. Okay. Mm hmm. I tried to get the blue. Pop. Immediately grab all the way. Well, that's a good shield. It's just keeping my whole damage. Yoink! I tried. Ow. I picked him up. He don't, you don't throw him very far because they just fall right at your feet. Uh, he's definitely going to need a wing blade. I can tell you that much. He's going to need a wing blade in the worst way. In the worst way. Yeah. At the, at, supports are always hard to tell exactly how good they are by the nature of support being so reliant on everybody else in the game. So I would say they're the hardest to tell how good they are right off the start. But I can say I have no idea where Chiron is. objectively in his current state, Atlas is the weakest guardian that I've seen in a while. Which is not to say that he's gonna be garbage, but as far as the last 
you know, two, three guardians or whatever that we got in Smite, think Cthulhu, Yamoja, etc. He is objectively weaker than those gods when I played them on PTS, if that makes sense. So. To be fair, all of those gods got nerfed yeah, out time. the wazoo. So. <laughs> to be fair. Your middle tower is under attack. We take the battle to them. Put Cybertron. Feel the weight of the world. Got a four man ulti. Does that mean something? They're all here. Yep, they sure are. Okay. I'm crashing down. Mm hmm. I'm meditating so hard. I tried it. You sure did. I'm crashing down. Sure did. Okay. Uh huh. Yo. Your whole pile. You think he's gonna be buffed and then overpowered and then nerfed? He can feel it. I'm trying to think though, like, what could they buff that would make him OP? That's like what I'm trying to think. Like, what is what is the change that would make him? You just think his one damage? I mean, so how's that lane clear going? The thing is, is, I think they could probably buff his damage pretty decently without breaking him. You know, like I think I think they could give him some some decent more damage without breaking him. I think there's quite a bit of quite a bit of wiggle room within that regard. I don't know if they'll give him more damage though. Cause here's the thing. The way that his kit is designed, if they give him too much damage on an ability like his one, that is when you could start to see him transition over into the solo lane, which is obviously what they were trying to avoid in the first place. So it might be a catch 22. In order to make him a viable support, they've got to give him more damage, but by way. giving him more damage, they yes. make him a good solo lane. Could be. Okay. It could be one of them predicaments. Your team has destroyed the right team. There's a whole team coming that to you, dude. so fast. Like a what? whole team. Like a whole team. Yeah, I don't know what I'm trying to accomplish here. <laughs> They're accomplishing more than me, that's for sure. Dang. <laughs> I wanted to I wanted to go for it so bad. So, <laughs> so Chiron hasn't fight me or fought me most of the game, right? Mm -hmm. But um, when I press T, it's the Atlas top damage. Yeah. Oh no. Oh no. It's not going well. That's what it's concerning. I can tell you right now, I have not been doing damage. I thought you meant I thought you meant their Atlas. I was like, that makes sense. He's got a mystical mail. Okay. Baked up Poseidon. Wow. Okay. I mean, I can't deny the facts. I do have top damage and top mitigated. So. 
I don't actually know what that means. I, I actually don't. I guess theoretically I shouldn't be getting a heavenly because of his three, but I kind of feel like his three doesn't really work like that. So what? What do I know? Uh. That was OP confirmed. Need to nerf quick. <laughs> quick, nerf him. No. I mean, not to brag, but I am level 13. Nice. I'm the same level as our mid laner. So, so yeah. <laughs> I got to actually fight a person for the first time this game. I said, fuck it. <laughs> Neza hasn't leveled up in the last like three minutes, so that's nice. That's good. Bum -bum. Mm -hmm. We must keep a watchful eye. No, no, Sergeant. That's a negatory. <laughs> I promise. You have a gift coming, right? We tried. Yo, take five. They have so many. They have so many. <laughs> and they do so much damage. We do not do the damage. I'm going to, I don't know, get tier two, maybe a Phoenix. Not even a little. Your life. Mm hmm. I mean, there's no reason why you should ever get it fully charged. So I don't think that's super relevant. Turtle, unless you mean like, unless you mean like if you let it channel the whole way, but if you mean like get hit by every dot or whatever, like there's no reason you should ever get hit by every single one of them. Cause it's like what, eight? How many, how many times this thing proc? At every 0.5 seconds for so we five seconds. Or At least I'm not top damage anymore. We got that going for us. Yep. For the amount of nothing I've done all game, we're not that far behind. Uh, have we been upgrading Death Toll or buying us? I upgraded. You can do either. Okay. Embrace there's is a good. lot I of like uh, because it's Mimi. There's a lot of variability right now in Hunter builds, actually. A lot of good items out there for them. Yeah, I'm neat. I kind of want to fail. Maybe I'll sell it. Uh huh. Go for it. Do I think he would see pro play in his current state? I don't see a reason right now why you would pick Atlas over the other guardians. Uh, uh, nope, 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 nope. nope. Yeah. Not in his current state. Ow. Ow, I wish I could move. I'm alive! I am not! Good luck! Someone's gonna tank that. Double kill. We're gonna get a Phoenix. Maybe. Maybe. There, there is a lot of things that they can very easily tweak on him in order to bring him to a very good state. Just right now, in his like PTS format, it's not it.
His dash not being slow immune is a field bad, by the way. Like, that's a good combo. Like, that one two combo is nice. Slow them, pull them in. Boom. That's nice. Okay. Is he fun, though? Uh. I think his kit would be fun if it didn't feel so lackluster in terms of just like the impact on the game, you know what I'm saying? Like I think his abilities themselves are fun. He just doesn't feel that fun because like you don't do any damage, but you also have to wait a really long time before you can use your abilities again. Y you know, you don't have He's not gonna like set up an objective steal. Can I mess a jogger? Yeah, he needs a little love. He'll need a little love. He's got a great CC. Sure he does. He's got a great CC. But having like, but having great CC and smite is not enough. Plenty of gods have great CC. Geb has great CC and his ultimate also hits you for 900 damage. You know what I'm saying? Slay. Hold up, right? Come to me. Um, I can also. Going. You're shelled, you're meditating. Pick him up. Got him. Slowing. Jeez. I see you see them as long as I could. They are low, but. Oh. Oh no. Not even close or something. Mm -hmm. They are fast. Oh, <laughs> not even close, eh? No, <laughs> you will not me. I also think, to be fair, I think he will pair really well with a big damage mid lane mage. So I think like Scylla, Ra, Thoth, Poseidon, etc., will make a lot of sense with him because he does have that setup and we have a Terra mid. So I also think that that's part of it. I think that he's gonna pair really well with like huge damage follow-up. Massive and and her ult. Yes, yeah, it's not. You know, a big mage ulti. Like he wants, cause he's got so much potential setup. He wants a big follow-up nah, ability. Was the it was, uh, he wants oh. a big one. <laughs> not the play. Uh, maybe. Just, just, just an inkling. So that would also help me out a lot. Because he, he provides a lot of setup, but not a lot of anything else. You know? Compressing down. Oh my god, I was actually so close to stealing that. Challenging my ult. Going for Poseidon. My goodness. Picking up Chiron? What? E? Okay. I'm pushing Medic. Poseidon had to run away. That Nezzo's like by himself. Poseidon will be coming back looking at Bear. Aww. Uh, Poseidon could be right around this corner. Sure is. I'm going to mid. Come crushing down. Still looking for Poseidon. Pick him up. Whoa. Or not. I think he got Terra Sun out of my grab. That's interesting. Like he was definitely like I, I was in the range of it and he just never hopped into my hand. I'm not sure if he hopped into my hands exactly when you stunned or so he got stunned out or if it just died. But 
I feel like he got something out of it, honestly. I don't think I got interrupted. I might have gotten shockwaved. But to be fair, there was so many. There was so many ability effects happening. Oh, it might have been a really hot Geb shield. That's a good call. It might have been a really fast Geb shield. Because if he Geb shielded perfectly, it wouldn't even get picked up. You're dead to fire minions. That's a good, that's a good call for sure. Your middle tower is under attack. For sure, it could be that. I also think a good buff to him could just be like various forms of CC immunity in places that make sense. Sure, just get to the rest of his team. Yep. Like knockback immunity on his two or slow immunity on his three, you know? Not like a lot, but just like things that kind of feel like they make sense within the kit. Let's get some very shallow wards. We know how the split push is in this community. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. On my way. Nice try. Miracle to the rescue. Ah, rats. Alright. Bolstering my defense. I mean. Uwu has been playing him in the solo of this game and he's 8 and 3 and 19. I, mean, I think that's more to do with the fact that his team is just kind of generically winning and it's Poseidon has 21 good. kills, uh, but you know, I mean, okay. it's not horrible. I mean, I guess we can look at his damage numbers at the end of the game and be like, ah, oh, would have made more sense to just have a warrior or whatever, but. I'm actually going to get straight for the drugger. Someone can get the, uh, the fire minions. Somebody take this red that's not me. I concur that he's one of the best aesthetic gods ever put in smite. I feel like it's very useless on me. His his aesthetic combined with his sound effects are freaking high. Like the one sounds like it would mess you up. It don't, but it do sound like it. It sure sound intimidating. I do not want to fight here. Mm-hmm. We have to fight to kill that before side. the... Uh-huh. Poseidon tier. We have to fight him outside the Phoenixes. Nice. Poseidon bees and Aegis? Him. Nice. Okay. They had a couple still here. Yep. Looking at Neja, picking him up. Yoink. That's his beach. Diving for Chiron. Nice. Pick him up. Yoink. Uh, somebody's got to defend left. Somebody's got to defend left. I'll do it. I'll do it. No, you do more damage. Okay, okay. You got it. I'm trying to get over to Arachne. I've got a shell for you if you can make it. Oh my. Yo, can we end the game? Maybe. I'm we got, yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, it's not actually right against the cam. Okay, let's go mid. Yep. Your left Phoenix has been destroyed. If you, that'd be a huge gap kill if you can finish it. Nice. We got to get the Phoenix. Oh uh, no, Poseidon is going to be out. out. It's one Poseidon. For a 10. I can ultimate soon spawns. No, I don't think we can do it. Dang. That sucks. We got the Phoenix though. Yeah. <laughs> it should not, because it's not an auto attack. No. Oh no. They're going to go for the reverse. Trying to pull them off you? You oinked them? Run! Nice. I'm I'm running. I'm gonna use my stupid little dash. I'm gonna pretend to run too. <laughs> Poseidon still kind of making his way this way. 
Okay. Primordial essence. Go. <laughs> if Chiron is not up immune in his run, then Atlas should be that too. Exactly, that's, that's what I'm saying. Like it, it, it already it. makes sense yeah. within like the smite rules. Don't mind me over here just racking these minions, dude. They are here. We once again have to fight them out towards here. We got Arachne up in four. Okay, I'm gonna look for the little bit of pressure here. Nice. Looking up a sign. Huge. I just got yeeted by Geb. Backline. Okay. Meditating. I got a huge double weave proc. Oh my god, looking for the Chiron that's a dash down. Uh, yep. We have to just we keep shoving through. We got 50 seconds. We want to shove this all the way through to their Phoenix. Yep. I'm just minions. Pick it up, Chiron. Yoink. Okay. You're shelled. I have all his hand. He dashed again. We back to you guys. Whoa. No. No. <laughs> That's the most smite PTS thing I've ever seen. I'm saying that we would have won. I'm saying that we would have killed them both and then ended the game. Thank you for supporting the Twitchiest community. If you'd like to see more videos, make sure you subscribe to the channel and always hit that bell for notifications so you don't miss any of the upcoming videos. Thank you for all your support and have a twitching day, y'all.